Pam Graham here. Today's video is about the neighborhood of Rava, which is in the Lake Asbury area of Green Coast Springs. So let's go ahead and get started so you can see why houses in this neighborhood do not last very long. Just to give you a little information about the neighborhood, there are over 200 homes in Arava, and there are three to four bedrooms, two to three bathrooms. They start at 1,200 square feet, go up to 2,900 square feet. There is an HOA, which takes care of the playground and the three ponds that are in the neighborhood. The price for that is 240 a year, which makes it one of the lower priced HOA neighborhoods. You may have noticed the do not feed the duck signs. At one time, there was a duck uprising. The numbers were growing steadily every day. They were taking over the neighborhood. First the ponds, then the playground, and if they saw you coming down the road, they would cross the road for no reason. And if you honked your horn at them, they would look at you and walk even slower. They are very passive aggressive, but cute at the same time. At the realization that Araba was being taken over by these ducks, the HOA put up the do not feed signs and sent out letters that told the residents not to feed them and don't even look them straight in the eye. Eventually, realizing the gig was up, the ducks waved the white flag and migrated somewhere else. There's still a few ducks around, probably talking about the good old days, but they aren't trying to take over the neighborhood anymore.
the tour is almost complete. If you like what you saw and have questions, feel free to call or text me at the number that you're going to see on your screen. I've also included more information about Arava in the description box below, including a home search to see what homes are selling for in Arava. So check that out along with the free guides and leave me a comment on your home search or if you have questions. And don't forget to subscribe because I put out new videos every week.